Hi, welcome to Lynn's Recipes. Today I'm going to make an apple butter pumpkin pie. This is a little bit different from your traditional pumpkin pie because it has the apple butter. I thought it might be something you might want to use for your holiday table. The amounts of the ingredients that you're going to need to make the pie will be listed in the information box below or you can find it on the website. The ingredients are pumpkin puree, and this is from a can, you can make your own if you want. Apple butter, this is homemade and it's very easy to find at the grocery store if you don't want to do homemade. Dark brown sugar, you'll need ginger, allspice, nutmeg, cinnamon and salt, maple syrup, beaten eggs, evaporated milk, and you're also going to need to line a pie dish with a nine inch pie crust and you can either make one yourself or you can get one pre-made at the grocery store. You're also going to need to preheat your oven to 350 degrees. I'm going to start by putting my pumpkin puree in this big bowl. Along with the apple butter. The brown sugar. The maple syrup. And if you wanted to, you could substitute sorghum or molasses for this and the spices. Get them all off of there. I'm just simply going to start whisking this together to combine. Breaking up the brown sugar. Okay, so now we're going to add our beaten eggs and the evaporated milk. And I'm just going to continue mixing this together till it's smooth. Okay, this is all mixed together. So now I'm going to pour this into my pie crust. And now I'm going to put this in the oven at the 350 degrees for 50 to 60 minutes until it's set. My pie cooked for an hour. I've just taken it out of the oven and what I'm going to do now is I'm going to remove it off of this tray and put it on a cooling rack and I'm going to let it cool completely before we serve it. I'm ready to serve my pie so I'm going to take a knife and just cut a slice. Get it out. This is apple butter pumpkin pie. I hope you enjoy it. 